Hi, so. Hey. 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 So this is gonna be our very hey. late um, hey. pregnancy vlog update. Um, today. Jazz can't say hey enough. Hey. Um, today we are technically 15 weeks and five days, so we're, we're just giving kisses. We're gonna give a kind of like a what's been going on with us. So if Jazz can stop kissing the camera, watch your pipe pad. What is that? Yeah. Is that Donald? Yeah. So this this week, so 15 weeks and five days as of today. So this week. Yend. Um, I kind of. Hey! <laughs> Jazz, watch your pie pad. Jazz, watch your pie pad. Hi. She won't stop. Um, Jazz, stop. Can you stop? Stop. Where's Mammy? Where's Lammy? All right, can you play with Mammy? I think she's thirsty. Give her some of your drink. I have a bad habit of biting my lips. Sorry. Okay, so 15 weeks and five days today. Um, over the weekend, um, I've gotten a cold type thing. Um, allergies. How's it going on? Sorry. Um, and it sucks. And it's still going on. But hopefully tomorrow it's going to be gone. Normally by the third day it's gone. Hopefully tomorrow it is done. Um, so. Going back over our journey. Um, we had. <clears throat> um, I failed IUI. And then we. Kind of kept on taking medicine. And figured. We would try. But it's not going to happen. Kind of. We were just going to have sex like normal kind of thing. Um, and, well, it happened. And we got pregnant. And here we are today. So, um, there were three RE appointments that I had. Um, my last one, I was at 11 weeks before I kind of got the, you're good to go. You could go off to your OB now. Sorry. It's 830 and I'm just tired. Um, so, my first appointment with my OB was on February the 1st, which was about seven days ago, and basically, just kind of normal, here's a list of stuff you can take, here's a list of stuff you can't take, da 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 whatever, 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 and, um, yeah, so there was that, um, and we got to listen to the baby's heart rate, and she swears we're going to have a boy. Um, so it is almost everybody else. But I don't know. I don't have any clue whatsoever. I swore Jazz was going to be a boy. But I think that that's just because I wanted a boy. Not because I, I felt like she was going to be a boy. I just wanted a boy. Um, so, I really, I don't know. Um, differences between Jasmine and this baby is one with Jazz, I was super sick all the time. She's doing like this. Um, I was super sick all the time with Jazz, so and I religiously took prescription nausea medicine, so I didn't feel sick. Um, with this pregnancy, I've got, gotten sat sick once, but I felt nauseated. But normally, it's if I wake up earlier than I normally do. So, so normal day I normally set an alarm for 8 30 and I set an alarm for 9 um 8 30 is for jazz to get up <laughs> um and for daddy to start getting her ready 9 is for mommy mommy gets 30 more minutes even though I really don't get 30 more minutes um and here recently jazz has been waking up earlier than 8 30 yay um so yeah um kind of and if I wake up, like, really early, like, earlier than 8.30, that's when I normally feel sick. Um, 
I'm so tired. Also. Can you stop now? No. No. Watch your pie pad. You got Goofy and Donald on your pie pad. Watch your pie pad. Sorry, iPad. It's technically my iPad. Hers is over here charging. Because we were just in the car. So, anyways. um, Other than that. The sick thing. Um... I really, I, I don't know. There is, I mean, I just, there's really not a lot of differences in a sense. Um, because still, you're, you're pregnant and things are changing. Um, with Jazz, I always, what's wrong? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I always wanted cookies and sweet stuff. With this baby, I've been craving steak <laughs> and um, bye. Bye, hey. Hey. and like potatoes and rolls like I really mm -hmm. want to go to Texas Roadhouse my birthday was January 11th hey. it's February now so I've been wanting Texas Road stop yeah. I've been wanting Texas Roadhouse for yes. almost a whole month um, that's my biggest Craving is that I've wanted that so bad. Can you stop? You're not listening. Anyways, um, we're, we're I'm talking about the baby. Can you stop? Jazz is being potty trained, and she's really good about going TT. Did you go TT today? Huh? Did you go TT today? No. Did you go TT today? Don't lie. Did you go TT today? You didn't go TT on your potty. Daddy's closing my iron board. Anyways, there was no TT on a potty today at all. Because this morning, I not I don't know why I did it like that. This morning, I woke up with cramps, and so I ended up going to the ER. Um, pretty much. After they finally found the baby's heart rate, heartbeat, um, almost gave me a heart attack in the ER just from that itself. Um, but after they finally found it, they were like, oh, it sounds fine. Nothing really to worry about. There's a prescription. Send you on your way. Okay. I guess. Yeah, sure. So... Whatever. My next OB appointment is on the 7th of March for my anatomy scan, which is going to be interesting because, like I said, everybody thinks that I'm having a boy, but I honestly I have no idea. I have no idea. I ask Ralph what he thinks. He's, he's yeah. But other than that, I did do some at-home pregnancy gender tests. Um, and... Just to kind of go through the tally, um, I wonder, give me one second, I wonder if I have my book in here, I did have it in here, I don't, seems like I did, give me one moment. You let it fall. It didn't stop recording. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah. Stop. Stop. Sorry, my laptop fell off. And surprisingly, when my MacBook fell off the bed, it. <laughs> It closed and everything, hey. and it didn't stop recording. Hey. Jazz, you said hey. Can you stop? Hey. Stop. You're going to press the button. So, sorry. Um, just to kind of go over this. Stop. You're yelling for no reason. No, you stop. No, I'll give you the picture of the baby in a minute. Wait, one minute. One minute. So, this is our stop. Stop it. I'm going to give you the pictures of the baby in a minute. This is what having a two-year-old is like. 
So, these are our pictures from our ultrasounds, from our second and third ultrasound and our RE. Um, this was the first. It's really far out. And then this was a zoom in of that day. Um, and then this was at 11 weeks. And I don't know if the baby just moved its head at the wrong time or what, but this is zoomed out. Let's go to turtle. And then zoomed in. It's like it's its head. It's like it looks like it has a beak on it. It's at 11 weeks. Here, take the pictures of the baby. Take it. Be sweet. All right, so we're just going to run down the list. Um, I just have to find it really quick. I have not been doing anything in this book. I've been doing it. Um, my other planner. I thought it was going to be in here, and it's not. So, in my... Ooh. Can you stop? No, you stop, because you're making me mad. You stop. 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 Right now. Stop. Sit up. Sit you're, No, because you're pissing me off. She's just, like, laying on top of my arm. Pick your chicken up. Scissors if I can find it and it's not in here. Okay, so it's basically a list. So I have this bump pregnancy planner and I have another one that comes with it. It's the book itself is orange and the binding is blue. It's a little bit smaller and I keep it in my purse. So I'll go with what I can. I don't remember all of them, so that's why I was gonna pull out the book and go down the list. But if you don't stop, this is ridiculous. You're ridiculous. You must be about to pass out. Good night, night. Where's the other picture of the baby? Anyway. Um, so, when I do the necklace thing, it looks like it goes around in a circle, but I honestly am not quite 100% sure. Get your nasty chicken nugget off me. Get it off of me. Put it in your box. Put all that in your box. You know what mommy told you, if you're not going to eat it, you got to leave it in your box. Clean this, uh-uh, clean this mess up. Clean it up, Jess. All this mess, she, I guess that's a good thing. She picked all the fried stuff off of her chicken nuggets. And I'm sitting here cleaning it up while I'm fussing at her about cleaning it up. Anyway, so other than that, there was, there's a thing on here that I've only seen it on YouTube where people do Drano crystal in your bee, um, and uh, um, baking soda or baking soda or one of either one I can't remember. Maybe your bee. Drano, if it turns brown, it's gonna be a boy. If it tastes like a greenish color, it would be a girl. And with the other, if it turns. No, if it fuzzes up, fizzes up, like has a, like a beer, you know, when you get a beer in a mug, if it's got a crown, let's call it a beer, it's got a crown on it, um, a head, a crown or a head, I don't know, whatever, um, it, uh, it's going to be a boy, if it doesn't fizz or any, have any foam on it at all, it's going to be a girl, so, both of those said boy, um, I was going to do the red cabbage test, however, um, didn't have any red cabbage and neither did Target. That was the only place I was going to stop and the child is kicking me in my back right now. And for those of you with a two-year-old and pregnant, um, well, let me put it this way, with a crazy two-year-old, a silly girl, um, and pregnant, I feel for you because I know exactly what you're going through because you're dealing with this.
ridiculous. <laughs> Anyways, she's sweet, but she's crazy. So, now I'm um, 15 weeks and 5 days. My next appointment is on March the 7th to have our anatomy scan to find out what we're having. So, I guess what we'll do before, sorry, moving on. Um, cause there's really not anything else to say. I really haven't had any other symptoms, um, other than just being pregnant, um, being tired, my back hurting. I mean, you know, my boobs hurting, nothing extreme. This whole thing, I feel like every time I do a video, I'm never pretty because I never have my makeup on just because when I think about doing the video, it's normally at night. Jess, get in the bed. Get up there. Get all the way up there. So we're going to do a belly shot so you guys can see my belly. Here we go. So this is from the side with my shirt on. And from the front side. That's crazy. Here is our belly. I'm on my cover up. It's Marilyn Monroe and roses. Um, the roses are covering her up. So, this is my belly. My belly. I have some stretch marks that I had with Jazz that are kind of coming back out. Um, they kind of came back. They kind of came out after pregnancy. Um, more than before. So. That's that. Um, and I just stepped on my daughter's hand, and then she farted. <laughs> Anyways, um, thanks for you guys who actually do watch my videos and kind of keep up with what's going on. Um, and yeah, <laughs> um, it's just crazy being pregnant with a toddler. I'm not even gonna fake it at all. Um. It's crazy <laughs> uh, with a toddler and expecting another one on the way and you're needing to kind of, you know, get one transition out of a baby phase and then kind of still at the same time kind of prepare yourself to kind of go back in it. Um, hey! <laughs> it's sweet. I'm not going to lie. It's sweet. But at the same time, hey! it's crazy and it's hectic and... It can be hard at times. It can be very hard and very stressful. So, enjoy <laughs> everything, every little moment of preciousness you get. Um, because then there will be the tantrums and all that lovely stuff um, that comes with it too. Anger, <laughs> whatever you want to call them. Um, so, anyways, you guys have a wonderful evening and whatever. Bye.